Welcome back guys to Cyberpunk 2077. It's part 11. We're in part 11 now and we previously just met Johnny Silverhand, Keanu Reeves himself. Guys, I'm really stoked to see where this play session gets us to and what's in store for our V. Guys, let's get to it. Talk to the stranger. I'm guessing that objective is referring to Johnny Silverhand himself. Can we? Oh, uh, they're talking about a different stranger, apparently. Looks like old Johnny's just gonna keep tapping his head. Alright. Oh, jeez! <laughs> Who you work for, start talking! Fuck. Fuck. Dude. He's like in my head right now. Fuck Whoa. Chip. Rip the thing out myself. No, wait! Crap. See you never, asshole. Now like that, stick some iron in your mouth and pull the trigger. Damn. I can feel it. Our minds touch it. I'm like mold on fruit creeping into you. Nothing I can do about it. You hear me? I'd puke if I fucking could. It's just a copy of the end grammar. I'm out there somewhere. Gotta be. Dude. Leave me alone. Get out. Just get the fuck out. Led to the head. Only thing that will fix this. Hear me, asshole. A bullet to the fucking brain. <laughs> oh, fuck me. Dude, I can't imagine having that stuck in my head. Whew. Holy crap. Playing for time. Four street cred, new gigs available. Five new gigs, holy crap. Dear Mr. V, as you did not return to... Read a message, what does it say? As you did not return to the vehicle following your visit at the Notel Motel, I elected to transport Mr. Wells' body to his family. Hey. Uh, good? Right? Regina Jones? Who is this? Hey, V. Regina Jones here. Heard you're looking for work at Watson. Just so happens I'm one of its main employers. If you don't want to waste those talents of yours, check the gigs I sent you. Do good work, and there's more where that came from. I'll be in touch. Coach Fred? Huh. Couple of words about who you're going up against. Kabuki, won't spoil this, just come and see. Oh, interesting. A bunch of different... Okay, Jackie Wells. Ah, oh, this is... Guys, I'm still upset about this whole situation from last... What's well, taking so long? Move your ass, you see? Dex is waiting on us. Ugh. Oh. Uh, those were old messages. Dang it. I'm actually, I believe it or not, I'm still pretty torn up by that, guys. 
Yeah, we got one perk available. No attributes. So let's spend it. Uh, let's look at intelligence real quick. Massive vulnerability. Advanced data mine. Almost in. Increase breach time of protocol. Let's do that. I'm kind of into the hacking thing. I'm kind of getting that the interest in that. So we got stock up on ammo, optional. Open your inventory and put on some clothes, optional. I like I walk around naked if I want, I guess. Find something to eat, optional. Check your email, optional. Dude. Let's see, can we find anything to eat? What do we got here? Nothing? Oh, burritos, okay. Take. Oh, I guess I didn't use it yet. Let's check my inventory real quick. Oh, yep. We naked. We need some clothes. Do we get anything unique? Anything cool? What's this? Oh, that looks... No, what am I doing? Uh-oh. <clears throat> no, that... I look injured and, like, recovering. What is that? <laughs> No, I don't want the... Can we unequip the special? Unequip. There we go. We just run around naked, I guess. Or we can find something useful. Let's see what we got for pants. Anything? Alright, you know what? I, it's, I look weird. It's a weird combination. <sighs> but we're gonna go with it. Clo I don't have any clothing sets. Like this. I already looked at that. Alright. All right, stock up on ammo, find something to eat, check your email. Oh wait, hold up. No, back up, inventory, wait, back up. We got cyberware and backpack. What's in the backpack? Holy crap. Wow, quick hack, components, components, filters, all, all the weapons right there up front. Got a couple greenies that do a little better damage than what's currently equipped. And that right there is a rare, 117. Oh snap, we got a, quite a quite a situation here on items. Uh, I just bought a burrito, I think. Yep, right here, let's use it. Remove burrito. Alright, I found something to eat. That didn't work, or I gotta go somewhere to... I thought I could just do it here. Ammo. Let's go stock up on ammo. Where's our ammo boxes? Do I gotta go somewhere for that, too? Leave the apartment, but hold up. What about my other options? Ammo case. Where do I go for that? Where is it? Here we are. Stock up an ammo. Okay, it looks like look, looks like we're gonna have to go to the journal for official options. Check your email. Looking around for that one. Check your email. Optional. Right here. All right, there we go. All right. Messages. Rent past due. Oh snap. Dear sir or madam, I record show. We have not. Receive this month's rent payment for your unit in Mega Building H10. In accordance with the tenan tenancy agreement, any subsequent payment delay will result in forced eviction from property. Yay! Past due rent, Mega Medicine Lottery. Yeah, we've seen those. Alright, I think that's it. Uh. Find something to eat. What is this?
Oh, eat and drink. There we go. Wow. All right. Takemura here. We must meet. Come to Thomas Diner. Hmm. Why would I do that? Because I am the one who saved your life. I haven't managed oh. to get my head straight yet. Not after everything that happened. That will not happen anytime soon. And so what? If you intend to leave, you must re-enter the ring. The bell has already told. Thomas Diner, I am waiting. Meet with Takamura. Okay, playing for time. What are these guys doing? Ah, shit! Something ain't right. Gonna shoot us! Oh shoot, I'm glitching out here. Uh oh. When danger lurks, trauma team will be there. Sign up for our platinum plan today. Because your life is worth Oh jeez, I'm glitching out. Open up. Cause a frickin' silver hand man. Hey. I'm all woozy. Oh man. Uh, ah. Okay. Sorry guys. I'm still this far and I'm still soaking up what what's going on around here. No, I ain't skipped town yet, dude. Hello, I'm Eric McBall with WNS News. Today is a sad one in our city's history. Mayor Lucius Ryan has passed away. We learned of Mayor Ryan's death from oh. his family. He died peacefully in his sleep. The exact cause of his death has not been released, but initial reports suggest coronary implant failure. The remainder of Mayor Ryan's term will be... I don't know what's going on in the city, man. <laughs> associate, Weldon Holt. Holt has also announced plans to run for mayor in the upcoming election. Today, uh, I miss Jackie still. Aw, oh, new contact mayor. added. Mama Dear Wells. Friend. Oh, why? Pick up. Oh, jeez. Here we go. Sorry, I was in the middle of something. I'll call you later. <sighs> Sorry, I was in the middle of something. I'll call you later. Ah! That is so sad. Girl, you look drunk coming out of, out, out of this thing, out of that thing, whatever that is. Alright, let's go meet up with Takamura. Figure out what's going on. It's a beautiful day, huh? Are you a cop? See? Si? Hello? <laughs> Alright, come on. Oh yeah. Okay. I'm going over which way are we going? I guess I'm gonna walk there. Regina Jones, V, my favorite Merc. I got a Galena. Hold on, what? I got a Galena I'm selling. Hasn't been driven much. Uh, guy who owned for the last ten years was paranoid. For going outside because he was afraid they would zero him. Car sat unloved for all that time. But you can't escape fate, right? Stray lid caught him through his window. More of the story that you gotta grab life by the effing balls. So don't be Scrooge. Whip out your cred chip and buy this baby. <sighs> I'm wondering if I have my car or if there's a car available. Alright, we got a floater. Nice little glitch. <laughs> vehicle buying. Oh, shoot. Okay. A fixer just sent you an offer to buy a vehicle. Whenever you receive an offer, a new marker will appear on your mini map. To buy the vehicle, go to the indicated location and confirm your purchase. Uh, I, I guess I can. I just I don't have a lot of money. I don't know. Let's. Let's check that offer real quick. Journal. 
side jobs. We got, uh, <laughs> oh my gosh, we got side jobs. Oh, here we go. Let's track this one for a minute. Buy a vehicle, Thornton Galena. I don't have 13 grand right now, actually. Ah, crud. Alright, we're gonna have to figure out how to earn some money here in a minute. Perhaps after we meet Takamura. Let's keep tracking that for now. Give us a good time to look at the city from a uh, walking level. Tom's Diner. I know. I need. I definitely need to get my hands on a vehicle here. Oh wait a minute. Oh, dude. Dude. Asshole. I need to jack me a car next time I see that happen. Good. Good gravy. Looks like we're meeting in this hole in the wall diner. All right. Sit. You do not look so bad. Then, in the car, I doubted you would survive. What do you want? Why'd you help me? Is this about the biochip? What do you want? What's it you actually want from me? To begin, you must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Evelyn, what's she to you? She and Yorino Barasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. I'm thinking I ought to have a word with her myself. She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone very far away. <laughs> Just answered your own Just question. Answered your own question about where Evelyn is. Long gone. Why do you believe she could help you remove the chip? Does a corporation help her? Uh, no idea. Got no clue. Evelyn was knowledgeable about the relic. Had a large chunk of classified info. An enigma to be sure. But she showed that slyness he get in corpo agents. You know the kind. I too possess this slide as you speak of. You got tossed out, lumped with the outcasts, easily. Or have you forgotten? Mm. Sorry I couldn't be of any help. Don't have any time to lose, so... Hey, wait. I need you. Yorinobu Arasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. <laughs> Looking for justice. In Night City. I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. I have allies prepared to bring Yorinobu to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. And you think they'll trust the word of a merc? I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. Uh, what if Asuna want me to accuse you in front of Arasaka execs? So what? We stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. Certain procedures will be used to establish the truth. A lie detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. This corporation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics. What kind of people are we talking about? Exactly what kind of people are we talking about? People who hold Arasaka dear are its heart. People interested in the corporation's stable growth. 
You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Prep for the heist. Thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true. He's a pawn. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Besides, Anders Hellman escaped to Arasaka. Betrayed it. Now, Hanako-sama, I would first like to ask you... Fucking Saka scums everywhere. Hey, I was listening to that. Shut up. Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt. What did you say? You heard me. Let it go, Takamura. At least one of you's got some fucking sense. <laughs> Always a street kid. That's the role I'm playing. Tom's all right. Not afraid to speak his mind. That's all. He reminds me of my father. He also walked in a kitchen all his life. Last thing we want to do is to draw attention. I'm sorry. A stupid reflex. Thanks for the offer. Need to think about it. I'll get back to you. I need time to plan, organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is that you do not leave the city. Leave? Why would I leave? Need help. Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we just talked about some. Hmm. Try my luck with Evelyn Parker. With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she will not manage to now. Honor Among Thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes. I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. There's just honor, I believe. Yorinobu Arasaka would agree, I'm sure. The Parker woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about a plan B. Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Somebody's been busy the last few days. I will not sit and do nothing when there is information to be found. Things to prepare. Your job, basically. It was my job. Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Saburo-san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corporal rats will squeal when hanging by their tails. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place, the club called The Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the queen of fixers there, Rogue. No experience talking to people like that? She spot the corpo on you, in you? <laughs> take you for a suit? No, she saw me as Saburo-sama's killer. Rogue's well informed. Gets wind of most things that happen in the city. Might be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. The old man is choosy, expensive, and rude. I cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Hellman, whoever. 
I must see some friends, call in some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call you. Till then, I guess. If by some miracle you find the helmet, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. Oh, jeez. Zapper dumples and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. Arasaka's still a despotic machine, and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. You know, you got some nerve. First you had to kill me, now you want to be my pal. Make like nothing happened. You know you don't gotta speak out loud to talk to me. What do you want? And I've processed some shit, changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. Go fuck yourself, dick wipe. Hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. And I've taken a step back. Looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. You're the ghost of Christmas past, asshole. Any friends you had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know, Rogue. What do I say to her? Got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. Don't need convincing. Seeing your memories, gross. Rogue will dance to any tune I play or just get us to the afterlife. There is no us. Ugh, man. This is getting interesting. <laughs> Woo!